Do we look tired? We do. It's because it's 11:30 at night, and we're recording tuts, baby. Come on. In today's video, I'm going to share with you guys how to create this hook in literally less than two minutes using a actual template file inside of Adobe Premiere Pro. Now, you do actually have to make this template yourself if you don't want to, like, you know, pay money to get pre-made templates, which it's completely fine but if you just want to go ahead save time and actually use templates that i use each and every single day go ahead check out the viral hooks v2 pack but if not genuinely no worries at all you can go ahead and create it yourself just with your own hooks that you make so without further ado let's go ahead and get straight into adobe premiere pro first things first is you guys want to go ahead and open up viral hooks v2 so i went ahead and do that just go ahead and import it and then you guys want to double click this and then this just has all the assets but uh, when you actually go ahead and open it it's going to automatically open up the um actual viral hooks pack now this has about 16 hooks ready to go for you guys so you guys could go ahead and just choose whichever hook that you guys would like but real quick i'm gonna show off like this little feature right here if you guys want to go ahead and um change the overlays just double click this right here and just replace this overlay and then make sure the center of your overlay or transition is right here on this red marker as that's pretty crucial and also set the uh, blend mode to screen if you do replace it and also too you guys can go to graphics and titles to replace the fonts in the project so that way you could place all of these fonts with uh, your own branding you know type of font which i think is really freaking sick really sweet to do super easy now for this one since it's like kind of a no talking video it's just really showing off the m1 pro max i want to find something like pretty simple pretty clean so honestly this one's looking pretty good because it's got like good camera movement um that one's pretty dope maybe a little bit too too much um that one's pretty good that one's pretty simple uh, we're not gonna use that this one would actually be a pretty good one to use i'm um, not really feeling that one right now that one's actually really nice i like that i love that one let's see what else we got Ooh, we're gonna use this one so we're just gonna go ahead drag and drop or drag and select all of these Control c we're gonna go over here to the first thing and we're just gonna copy and paste this over in to the timeline just like so and then we're going to full screen this and make sure that this is kind of in the right spot so let's go ahead and just see what we're working with right now and that actually looks really good let's say maybe um let's actually just move this clip over a little bit more see how it looks banger and then i'm just going to actually cut all of the text right here just like so and then i'm also going to move this riser sound effect over here and then i'm also going to move this over here so it actually transitions which that's actually needs to go right here banger so that's actually like the hook pretty much done so i'm gonna do 2024 let's do m1 mac book actually let's do 2021 because it was 2021 and then my honest feedback as a content creator for the pro max model and then i'm just gonna go ahead go over here to f properties and then i'm also gonna just make the spacing a little bit wider like that and then there we go there's our hook. It actually looks really, really clean. And then the video just plays out. Then I think that looks really freaking saucy. Just go ahead, throw on some dope music and uh, you're good to go. And literally I was filming this video for probably about like five, six minutes. So I genuinely believe that's going to be like a four minute video. But anyways, guys, I hope this video was helpful. Just a little bit of extra sauce for you to, you know, maybe consider actually building your own hook preset pack or template pack. Um, just go through all your past edits, copy and paste the hooks, and then uh, just, you know, have it. So that way you can copy and paste it into your timeline and do exactly what I did. Or again, if you wanna go ahead and skip that process, feel free to go ahead and check out my uh, Viral Hooks V2 pack, as it's actually pretty dope. I use it actually quite a bit on my Instagram. So that is it for me today, guys. Remember, like, comment, and subscribe down below. If you guys wanna go ahead and watch this video on screen right here, go ahead, do so. Remember, take action, take over. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.